hi everyone in the last video we discussed about the mesh of this particular geometry and we have simulated and tried to study the thermals of this uh, model now i'll just directly go on to the results so this is kind of the thermals of this uh, cpu fan and if you have ever seen a cpu fan it is exactly like this so this is like the fan and you have the metal plates and we generally put the thermal paste here and put it above the cpu and this is how the heat is being dissipated so now let's see how we can actually plot the temperature along a particular line or a particular curve that is very important when you are interested to check the temperature of the particular geometry that you are studying especially when you are working with realistic geometries so i'll just go on to results and click on 1d plot group because in the 1d plot group you will have an option of line graph the line graph is very important because you can select a particular uh, edge that you can uh, see and check the plot so now let's say i want to select this outer ring okay i'll select the full ring and i want to check the temperature now i'll just click on plot it might take few seconds because it's quite a big model now i'll just click on study 2 and i'll click on list so i have model for 0 second 1 second and 5 second so if i click on 1 second and plot as you can see the temperature is like 293 and if i click on 5 and 1 and click on plot so at one second the temperature was around 293 and at five second it was around 295.4 and it is fluctuating around 0 0.4 to 0 0.8 okay so let's see a different approach what we can do we will select the metal plate and then check the temperature along a particular line so let's select the boundaries i'll select this side this side this side this side and let's move the other way around and maybe this one and we have selected almost all the side of that particular blade now what should happen is that since here we have supplied a 100 degree celsius uh, temperature so basically the temperature should reduce as we move this way it should fall uh, gradually now let's see the plot so you can see that it starts from 375 and then it reduces to some temperature now these two lines represents the two time so the five is the higher one the green one and blue is the one second mark similarly we can choose any sides so if i choose uh, this one it should show a higher temperature because this is kind of the source so if i click on plot as you can see it's at 395 that is the temperature that we have set for the source okay so this is how you plot the temperature along a particular edge of your model